Faith in hard times. I know how you feel, and I have often asked these very questions on many occasions. I've been battered, bruised, broken, and felt abandoned by God. Many nights I've cried myself to sleep and woke up the next day with a defeated spirit. In fact, many days I'd wished not to wake up, but would have been better than confronting my adversities. 2 Corinthians 5 7. For we walk by faith, not by sight. I was restless, nervous, anxious, stressed out, frustrated. But guess what, I made it. I am still here, and those troubles I encountered were all a part of God's plan for a great and mighty deliverance. Psalm 9-9. The law also will be a refuge for the oppressed, a refuge in times of trouble, hard times. For what it's worth, God does deliver his people from hardships. But for some if not most of us his deliverance is too often a distant reality. But there is hope, God is true, just, and faithful. And from experiences, he doesn't necessarily operate with our time frame, though we wish he would. But the bottom line is he delivers his people. Psalm 46 1. God is our refuge and strength, an ever-present help in trouble. Isaiah 43 2. When you pass through the waters, I will be with you. And when you pass through the rivers, they will not sweep over you. When you walk through the fire, you will not be burned, the flames will not set you ablaze. Proverbs 18.10 The name of the Lord is a strong tower, the righteous run to it and are safe. Philippians 4.6 Be anxious for nothing, but in everything by prayer and supplication, with thanksgiving, let your requests be made known to God. 1 Peter 5.7 Casting all your care upon him, for he careth for you. Not Romans 8.38-39 for I am convinced that neither death nor life, neither angels nor demons, neither the present nor the future, nor any powers, neither height nor depth, nor anything else in all creation, will be able to separate us from the love of God that is in Christ Jesus our Lord.